Hey guys, how's it going? It's 8-Bit Eric, and PlayStation 5 is right around the corner. Lots of people are excited and have several questions, one of them being which certain games from the PlayStation 4 could you carry over digitally, more specifically the PT Demo. So is the PT Demo playable on the PlayStation 5? Well, got some bad news for ya, says Wade Barrett. Uh, before we get to this article, if this is your first time coming to the channel, you haven't subscribed yet, why don't you go ahead and click the red subscription button down below, enable your bell notifications so you do not miss any of the updates. Konami came out, confirmed, PT won't be backwards compatible with the PlayStation 5. Konami's demo will unfortunately be left on the PlayStation 4, and this is a demo that's since grown um, a very popular following. You can't even get the demo anymore. Um, Konami removed it. <laughs> I don't know why they did that. Um, I guess that was stemming from the whole Kojima stuff and all that. And, and, and that is just a creepy picture right there. But yeah, Konami comes out and confirms it. So PT will not be backwards compatible on the PS5. Konami has confirmed to GamesRadar. And an email sent to us earlier, which is GamesRadar... Konami said that the content will not be available on the PlayStation Store, so users won't be able to re-download the content through the backwards compatibility feature to the PlayStation 5. Um, that's unfortunate and sad for people that actually own the demo and were hoping they could transfer it over. GamesRadar goes on to say, Last week we reported on how PT would have likely been saved through the PS5's backwards compatibility function. Sadly though, Konami has now revealed that PT will unfortunately only exist on the PlayStation 4 due to the reasons outlined above. So it is not going to be re-downloadable on the PlayStation Store. If you were curious about that, if that was something that you were wanting to hold hope for, um, sorry. <laughs> It's not going to happen. And this stems from an article that Games Radar did um, just the other day where they were, I guess, being hopeful. PS5 PT will live on for another generation with the PS5 backwards compatibility. They were hoping it would make the jump from PS4 to PS5 through backwards compatibility, meaning it's safe for another console generation. Now, according to them, it says the news was first noted over the weekend by Eurogamer, where the backwards compatibility of the feature means that the incredibly rare PT can be successfully transferred over, meaning it's not going to be trapped. Um, they got confused because Sony did come out and say all but like 10 or 11 PS4 games would be playable on the PS5 through backwards compatibility. Um, unfortunately, this isn't the case. <laughs> So, uh, I'm sorry if you guys were expecting PT to be playable via the backwards compatibility stuff on your PlayStation 5. Short and sweet little video. There's not much to add to this. Just a simple, hey, it's not working. Um, what are your thoughts down below? Me, personally, I haven't gotten to experience the PT demo. I always wanted to. I didn't download it when it first came out. Uh, and then, unfortunately, it was removed. It wasn't no longer downloadable. The whole Hideo Kojima mess that came out of that. Um, it's unfortunate what could have been, because this does look like it would have been a great horror game, a game that would have just sent shivers down people's spines. It's something that's just going to be living in the past, unfortunately. And with the digital age, stuff like this happens. Um, that's why I will never fully support digital gaming, because they could just pull stuff, cancel stuff like that, and you can never re-download it and PT suffered from that. Um, Konami, for whatever reason, just isn't continuing with it. <laughs> it's unfortunate, but yeah, if you have it, you're not going to be able to play it on the PS5, so it's forever stuck on your PlayStation 4. Uh, incredibly, really rare demo to have. Anyways, guys, what are your thoughts? Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you on the next one. Short and sweet video. Not 8-Minute Eric today.